What's up everybody, welcome back to Selenix Crypto. Uh, good afternoon and welcome back to yet another update on the Voyager token or VGX. Some news came out about uh, VGX, uh, VGX, well, that's what I wanted to talk about in this video, but apart from that, I also wanted to do a technical analysis on it. And kind of, uh, it's, it's more an analysis than a price prediction. I do wanna say that the price of VGX right now is influenced heavily by news and analyzing it is very hard, at least for me, all right? I'm just going to be honest with you. So um, that's why it's, it's more of an analysis, less of a prediction. I felt like you needed to know that before entering this video. The analysis is also going to be relatively hard. All right, so, so let's get right into it. Uh, the news that we found out about is, let's see if it's still here. Uh, yeah, FTX is in the lead to buy crypto lender Voyager Digital's assets out of bankruptcy. All right, so so that was the news. FTX, a major cryptocurrency exchange, is uh, probably buying the assets of Voyager Digital. Uh, that also means that they're buying all the VGX tokens. All right, they're not buying it right now. That's not why the price is going up. I think the auction uh, is like ends at the beginning of October. Uh, but that would mean, I, I don't think it means that Voyager... Uh, the exchange will stay like will keep existing but i do think they're going to do something with the vgx token all right so the vgx token will at least continue existing uh, and that's why today we got some small bullish moves all right compared to the other moves we've had over the last uh, months it isn't that big uh, but still it's it's some bullish news it is news uh, there's a lot of news around vgx right now but still I'm, i felt like uh, you needed to know about that Apart from that, if you take a look at the price, let's drag this away. It, the price is very messy. We found support at this major support level here at 62 cents. It was this very strong level, but altogether, what you can kind of see is that we're forming this this like market structure. There's there's a lot of bearish momentum, and then there's kind of it's it's kind of like this, right? Th this is kind of the the triangle we're in. Um, the market circumstances aren't great, so what we're basically going to have is we're either going to break down below this level right here at 60 cents after which we will probably drop down to this uh, 50 45 cents level and hold that level until we get more news and move according to that news so it's, so it's either that um or we're just going to keep consolidating here we're going to get some sort of a bullish breakout and that brings us up to 95 cents uh, but then again it's, it's just consolidating until we get the new uh, until we get news after which we will probably break out above 95 cents and get up to 1.1 and 1.25 um so as i said it's not really a prediction it's more of an uh, more, more of an analysis looking at important key levels if i would have to be honest with you i think something like this is the most likely scenario so that we stay on top of 63 65 68 cents consolidate on top of that break out of this bearish market structure and then stay consolidated between 95 cents and 60 cents until we get more news which is either bullish so then we move up to 1.1 or bearish then we move down to 50 cents all right that seems to be the most likely outcome right now for for vgx one of those two scenarios uh, and especially that last scenario i talked about uh, but as I said, it's uh, it's hard to analyze VGX right now. I really tried my best for you, uh, but I would definitely advise you to, most importantly, if you're investing and trading in VGX, I wouldn't, by the way, but if you do, just have some notifications on that news. The news is moving it right now, and that's also why it's relatively unpredictable right now. So that's my analysis for VGX right now. If you do have any questions about it, feel free to ask me down in the comments. Uh, but for now, I'd like to thank you all for watching and listening, and I hope to see you all in my next videos. Take care today, and bye.